Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Storytime. It's Miss Morgan here, and today for our theme, we're going to be talking about rainbows and clouds. So let's go ahead and get started with our welcome song, okay? The more we get together. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Now the more we read together. The more we read together, 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 the more we read together, the happier we'll be. With big books and small books, with short books and tall books, the more we read together, the happier we'll be. Very good and welcome everyone. All right guys, so are you ready for our first book? Okay. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, wave your arms. If you're ready for a story, wave your arms. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, wave your arms. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, sit so still. Shh. Very good. All right, so our first book about clouds and rainbows is How the Crayon Saved the Rainbow. And do we know what colors make up a rainbow? You have red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. And a little song that I sing to help me remember is red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet makes a rainbow. All right, so let's see how the crayons save the rainbow. The sun and the clouds were best friends. They worked together to keep the earth warm and gardens growing. But all of the things they did together, their very favorite was making rainbows so that the whole world was colorful and happy. Then one day, the sun and the clouds had a big fight. The clouds were blocking the sun and the sun couldn't shine through the earth. The sun went sizzle, sizzle, sizzle at the clouds and the clouds went clap, bang, boom, back. That's not very nice, is it? They stopped being friends and were never in the sky together again. Oh no. With the sun and clouds far apart, it was scorching hot on some days and damp and cold on others. Oh no. And worst of all, there were no more rainbows. Without rainbows, the flowers, streams, and even cities started to lose their color. Soon the earth was black and white. Could you imagine the world without color? But in one little town, in one little school, in one little desk, there was one little forgotten box of crayons, and the crayons still had their colors. The desk rattled and shook, clamored and clanked. All of a sudden, it toppled over and the box of crayons tumbled out. Oh, there they all are. Can you see them? Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet makes a rainbow. The crayons started to search for the colors. They raided marker bins and tore through art projects, but everything as far as they could see was only black and white. Oh no. The crayons looked out the window. The sun was all the way to one side of the sky. 
all looking so angry and the clouds were all the way on the other side looking gloomy. Oh, Indigo says, I miss all the colors. We can't even draw rainbows together now. But Violet says, wait, that's it. We need to save the rainbows. So the crayons started drawing little rainbows all over town, but nothing happened. The sun and the clouds didn't seem to notice. What can they do to make them notice? We have to make our rainbows bigger, Violet said. Working together, the crayons drew and scribbled. They made the biggest, brightest, most colorful rainbow the world had ever seen. Oh, I think that the sun and clouds are starting to notice. Ever so slowly, the sun perked up and the clouds floated in for a closer look. The sun and the clouds both peered down, admiring the giant rainbow that the crayons had drawn. What bright colors, said the sun. It's incredible, said the clouds. They looked at each other with great big smiles. The sun said to the clouds, remember when we used to be together all the time and make rainbows? The clouds nodded. I'm sorry for going clap, bang, boom at you. I'm sorry for going sizzle, sizzle, sizzle at you, said the sun. It's better being friends, said the sun, and the clouds agreed. They hugged, the sun shined brightly, and the clouds m misted happy rain. Ever so slowly, rainbows reappeared near and far, turning the world colorful once again. Oh, you see what happens when we work together? Oh, you get beautiful, beautiful colors when you work together, just like cloud and sun. Yes. All right, guys, so for our next song, it is called The Rain is Falling Down, and we are going to use our scarves. So if you have a scarf that you want to use with our song, you can go ahead and grab that or a sock or a pillowcase or anything fun. All right, so our rain is going to fall down like this and say splash. Then our wind is going to blow by and say whoosh really fast. Oh, then the sun is going to come out and say peekaboo. Peekaboo. Are we ready? All right. The rain is falling down, splash. The rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. The rain is falling down, splash. The wind is blowing by, whoosh. The wind is blowing by, whoosh. Fast and cool, fast and cool. The wind is blowing by, whoosh. The sun is peeking out, peekaboo. The sun is peeking out, peekaboo. Peeking here, peeking there. The sun is peeking out. Peekaboo! Very good job, very good. All right, so our last book is called Rain Drop Plop. And it's about a sweet little girl who is out in the rain and she has to go inside. But in this book, there's a lot of counting. So I think we should practice counting together, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, but this book has a trick. She counts backwards too. So let's put our ten fingers back up. Count backwards. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Very good job, everyone. Very good. All right, so here we have Raindrop Plop. One little raindrop, dark, dark sky. Two little raindrops, clouds go by. Three little raindrops, splat, splat, splat. Four little raindrops, boots and hat. Five little raindrops, shiny red coat. Six little raindrops, bright blue boat. Seven little raindrops, plop in a cup. Eight little raindrops, 
umbrella up. Nine little raindrops puddle fun. Ten little raindrops still no sun. Too many raindrops run, run, run. Back in the house now, that is that. Off with the raincoat, off with the hat. Ten little toes in a nice warm tub. Nine soapy bubbles, scrub a dub dub. Eight fluffy towels, soft and white. Seven brass buttons, shiny and bright. Six tiny marshmallows float in a cup. Five small pretzels gobble them up. Four furry squirrels want something to eat. Three hungry birds go tweet, tweet, tweet. Two bright eyes, what do they see? Out of the window, out by the tree. Raindrops stopping one by one. No more raindrops. Sun, sun, sun. Yes, don't we love when it stops raining? We can go outside and play with the sun. I know I do. Well, thank you so much for joining me today, and I will see you next week. Bye. Have a great day.